Okay. I don't understand you. I don't understand what the fuck is going on anymore, but I'm pretty sure... I don't know if any of you know what's going on on YouTube between Mr. Epsion and some guy 827 But if you don't know what I'm talking about, this is insane. I have lost all respect for you, Daniel. I have. I mean, at the beginning when I was still starting out on YouTube, I have lost all all I have lost all respect for you and that's sad but if you guys don't know what's going on Stevie also known as some guy 27 here on YouTube got a message from MDA also known as must destroy all about a dark uh, past about, about like a little dark part or very disturbing part of Stevie's life which contains like videos, messages, pictures of Stevie going insanely mad and cussing out his um, his fiance. Stevie made a video about that, and he owned up to every part of it. But what is so insane and infuriating is how Mr. Repsion got a hold of the messages. The the messages, the the pics, the videos, and how he's trying to do, trying to exploit it and trying to use it against some guy eight twenty seven. What I don't understand is how Mr. Epsilon can do this to a person. To to treat a person like that just because they made some negative videos against you? My god! I, I know that Onision is bad, but Jesus freaking crummy! What's going on right now is almost ten times worse than Greg ever fucking did. And I don't like Greg, but I'm pretty sure Greg has never fucking went out of his fucking way to make a a exploitatious video about someone's dark past just for views and for fucking money. It's sad too. And some guy at 27 made an update video about what Mr. Epsion did because Mr. Epsion commented in his update on the previous video saying that he's going to um, threaten to to expose and to show everyone the videos. Well, some guy cre some guy told him to go ahead that he doesn't even care because you threaten me all you want because but he it doesn't change the fact that this is stupid and way over Daniel's fucking head. It is. But this is what he said th th then he commented in the um, newest in his in some guy 27's video. He even said, there is no threat, it wasn't a threat, I'm just trying to explain shit. But hey, I'm guilty by your standards. But please take me to court or file something against me because it will be, be false upon internal investigation that I know. Daniel, I watched his videos fucking twice, actually no, not twice, I watched his videos probably like five times, both the long 16 minute video and the two minute video. Where in the blue fucking hell did he say that he was going to take you to court? So I showed the message to Stevie, and after a huge long thing, if Stevie ever, ever does take you to court, there's no, there is, there, here is a, there, you're, he, you're gonna lose. Because, you, he has a witness to a Twitter account that sends the Skype username and the YouTube channel. The fact that he exploits your his, his, the fact that Daniels is, is exploiting some guy 27's life for and, and harassment. It's 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 Jesus Christ! I don't understand the motive behind this. 
what you are doing right now is absolutely wrong. And, and it's so sickening and disturbing how you cannot ever own up to any of your shit. You can't. I don't know why you can't own up to anything. That whole situation with Must Destroy All, you still have not fucking owned up to it. Be a fucking man and own up to your bullshit! Make a fucking video saying that I am in the wrong, I am sorry for doing that, and I will never do it again. We, But we all know you, you won't. Because... You always try to be the person who seems like they are in the right all the fucking time to do whatever they fucking want. Like the fucking content ID system. Your fucking video on your on the goddamn content ID was talking about how you said that they would never that, that if anyone who created a full video, a mirrored video without your permission or whatever and they make vid money off of it you would probably use a content ID against on them. But that's okay. In my eyes, that is okay. What I don't find it okay is how you said that if someone used snippets of people's videos, and if they are using it against you negatively, posit uh, mainly negatively or positively, you would use the content ID system against them to make money! To make money. You were a nice guy when you started on YouTube, Daniel. You were. But now, you're a low-life, piece-of-crap coward who only cares about one fucking thing and one fucking thing only. Money. You keep saying that you're going to commit suicide at 25 years old. Dude, are you fucking insane? You know what? Fine. You keep saying that you want to commit suicide at 25, are you fucking thinking, just because you went to Africa does not mean, oh, I'm done with my life, I need to put a bullet through my egg or hang my neck in a fucking noose! No! Just because, okay, okay, you're 20, I don't even know how old you are, but you're probably, you're, you're early 20s, you're not even 25 yet, you're early 20s and yet you want to commit suicide. Dude, there are, you have so much in your fucking life that you can accomplish. But no. You want to end it all. Because you think in your fucking eye, in your mind, that you have done everything that you can to do. ARE YOU OUT OF YOUR FUCKING MIND?! ARE YOU OUT OF YOUR FUCKING MIND?! I'm 20 years old right now. I have more fucking brain power in my head to realize I have a lot to do with my life still on this planet before I kick the bucket. I'm in college. I'm about to graduate in like less than a week. Actually, actually no, in one week I graduate from college. I have my entire life ahead of me. I'm focusing it on good things. I'm not going to waste my life doing stupid, idiotic things like you're fucking doing right now. And you see that Jaws poster in the background? Maybe you fucking get that idea that maybe I... I'm a fucking movie buff. That's what I'm going into. I'm going to the film industry. I'm focusing more on film, projects, or anything. I might take a break from YouTube from, from some time pretty soon. But you know what, dude? At least I know that it, once YouTube has, like, completely fucked its own ass, I will probably just quit YouTube and move on with my life as a filmmaker because I knew that my time on YouTube is probably coming gone. I wasn't making an effort to partner. I don't care about partnership anymore since YouTube only does care about the big type partners. But still... This is dis disturbing. It's sick. You need to grow up, be a man, grow up a pair of balls, get a spine in your fucking back, quit being an exploiter, because that's what you do. You like to exploit people for money. Get a life. 
Grow the fuck up. Good lord, I'm more mature than you. That is so fucking sad. The fact that you would do this to a person who considered you a good friend. But now... I'm, I don't even I don't even know anymore. This is so sad. Do you do this a lot? I don't, I, I actually I don't, I don't even care anymore. I'm done. I'm going to click the unsubscribe button right now. I don't even care anymore because Mr. Repsion is just an unbelievable piece of shit. And you know what? I, I I don't honestly don't care anymore because to you this is probably this is probably one person unsubscribing you could care less. But honestly, I don't even care anymore because you're nothing but a piece of shit. Fuck you. And goodbye.